Today I'm joined by fellow British racing driver, five times Le Mans champion, Oliver Gavin, who's been the face of Corvette for 20 years. We're here at the beautiful Sunny Goodwood Motor Circuit and we are extremely lucky to have the first ever EU spec Corvette Stingray here with us. So Ollie, Ollie, thanks so much for coming. Tell me a bit about the car. Well, after 67 years of Corvette producing this car, we've, they've moved the engine from the front into the middle. It's quite the transformation, so I think we should get out on track and give it a go. So tell me the significant changes um, from this car, from obviously the previous generation. Well, so, you know, putting the, putting the engine in the middle has changed a number of things here. So we're now about 40 centimetres closer to the front of the car which the visibility is now improved. You feel that you've got that greater vision. You feel more connected with the road. When you actually first turn the wheel, you feel that the car is pivoting right around you. So why choose Michelin? So our competitors were on Michelin and they were beating us. So we thought the way to beat them was to get with Michelin. And that's what we did. And when we swapped to that Michelin tire, the performance gain that we saw is most probably the biggest performance gain that I ever saw in my time with Corvette Racing with just changing that one thing. So I've noticed that this car has Pilot Sport 4S Michelins on. Tell us a little bit about the marking on the side of the tire that makes this tire specific for this car. Okay, so the TPC on the side of the tire is the thing that's unique to the Corvette Stingray. That, this tyre has been developed by the engineers at Michelin. They've taken the, the, the racing technology and put it into the road car tyre technology, uniquely tuned for this car. So that was at Milford in, in Michigan. From there, we went to the, the Nürburgring and the Nordschleife, and I managed to, to drive the car there and, cool. and, and just see how the tyre works. And so final sort of certification uh, for, for the tyre. But yeah, it's, it's been a very, very good, strong link between Michelin and Corvette over the years. So is there a moment that stands out to you of racing with Corvette over the years? Oh, the, the win in 2016 at Daytona 24 hours was exceptional. I, you know, I'm in the car to finish, Antonio's in the sister car. We're racing like hell. Um, we've been told that we can race wheel to wheel and hard. but Which no, is rare with manufacturers. Yeah, exactly, no contact. Okay. Um, so the last 30 minutes, we're just going at it. And he gets by me into turn one and I manage to sneak back by him again and it's super close just like brushing past one another. And then the final lap, I'm coming into the bus stop, he's trying to pass me around the outside and I come off the bus stop. I'm leaping up and down in the seat, <laughs> trying to get the car to go fast. You know, like you are in the, in the yeah, go-kart. Go yeah, you're trying to get it to the line and I was screaming in the car, trying to get it over the line and we won by like a foot. After 24 hours of racing, it's unreal. incredible to find out about this car, the changes that they've made, how they're making these OEM PS4s work on this car, and I'm so excited to drive it up Goodwood Hill. 